Hey everybody, welcome back to my page, Hot Miss Express Tutorials. Today is a super special day because it's my... Wow, I can't believe that we made it, that I actually stuck to it. My mind is honestly blown right now. I just want to say, if this is your first time watching this video, we are figuring it out one video at a time. I have lots of things to talk about throughout this video. The first thing that I want to say is a huge, humongous thank you to my sister. None of this would have been possible without her and I'm just so grateful for her to have helped me started this YouTube page. I, I wouldn't be here without her. For those of you who have been watching since the beginning, my sister has helped me film these videos as well as edit the videos. She is a film major and she's in her senior year of college, so the most recent videos I've been kind of doing by myself with some friends. Everything that was and is good about my videos is all because of my sister, so thank you so much. I love you. Come back to me and help me. <laughs> Um, she's currently doing her senior thesis in school, so she's taking a little hiatus from helping me with my videos, so I'm doing my best, obviously, trying my best as we do in these videos. I figured since it's my three-year anniversary that we should get to know each other a little bit better, or at least you get to know me a little bit better. I have a couple questions that I wrote down that I thought you might want to know. The first question that I have is, what is your everyday look? What? I don't really have an everyday look. I think that makeup, there are so many colors and so many different ways that you can present yourself that I just do my makeup different, honestly, every time that I do my makeup or I just don't wear any at all. I definitely think that there are certain styles of makeup that I like more than others, but yeah, I don't think I have an everyday, like my go-to look. What is your favorite type of makeup to wear? And that would be lipstick. I I love lipstick. Ever since I was a child, I would I would put on lipstick. I feel like I could wear just lipstick and nothing else and I would be totally fine. Do you have a favorite brand of makeup? I don't know if I necessarily have a favorite brand of makeup. I know that when I first started really getting into makeup, I was all about Urban Decay. I was like, oh, this is the fanciest makeup that I have. Um, it was really cool, um, but now I'm definitely branched out and um, I use so many different brands of makeup. I will say that for my favorite lipstick, I really enjoy using Gerard Cosmetics. For my lipstick, that's not what I'm wearing today. I think I'm wearing um, Sugar Pill Cosmetics in the color Strange Love. My nose is seriously running today. I'm so sorry. It's winter. What is your favorite color to wear? Black. What is your favorite lipstick color to wear? Well, I think I like wearing all the colors. It really just depends on my mood, honestly. How do you deal with being a hot mess? <laughs> I think the best way to deal with being a hot mess is just to honestly laugh it off and I just work on bettering myself every day, you know, and learning from your mistakes. If you can't laugh it off, then it's just, it's just a sad life, I guess. What is my least favorite makeup to wear? And if you've been watching me for a long time, you know the answer to this. It's lip gloss. I hate lip gloss. So much, I've said it once, I've said it twice, I've said it a hundred times. I hate lip gloss. I just don't like that, I don't know, like, I have big teeth. I'll admit it, like, I have horse teeth, I don't care. I don't like getting lipstick on my teeth, which is why I always choose a drying, uh, like a liquid lipstick to wear. I don't like having the lip gloss, it w 10 out of 10 times will get on my lips. Like, no matter how many times you, like, put your finger in your mouth or, like, use the tissue or whatever technique you have, it will get on my teeth and I will walk around and I won't know. So I try to avoid that. Also, if you have, you know, you're having a great day, have your windows down, blaring music, and it just, your hair gets stuck in it, it's just, you know, I just don't need that stress 
in my life. I do try to show you looks with lip gloss on because I know that some people do prefer lip gloss. Who do I like to watch on YouTube for makeup? But it would be Nikki Tutorials and Candy Johnson. Um, if you haven't seen, I did a video where I tried following one of Nikki Tutorials. Tutorials? Um, it turned out really ridiculous, um, so I'll put that link in the video somewhere. What she said in doing her videos is it's built up a lot of confidence in her, and I feel the same thing with me in doing these makeup videos and, you know, talking to you guys and, and showing you guys what I got. And then the other person is Candy Johnson, and she just is, she's so positive, and just, she seems, she seems so humble, and she wants the best for everyone, and I just, I really like that. Um, like, literally, she says, if you ever see me walking down the street, like, make sure that, like, we get a hug, or something like that, and I'm like, literally, if we hugged, I would just, I would just cry, and then I feel like she would start crying, and it would just be a cry fest of love. <laughs> Lastly, I want to talk about my goals for future videos. So, something that I talked about in one of my last videos is I really want to stop saying so, so much. It is such a filler word. And, oh man, I just wish that my brain worked. Stop saying so. Number one. Oh. Uh, Number two, get better at editing. And lastly, it would be just to post more videos. You know, I had a goal to post more videos last year, and I definitely did post more videos than my first year, but but even more. Like, I would love to get at least one video out a week. I, it doesn't even sound like a lot, but like, to me, apparently, that's, that's too much. Goal number four, I would love to have a fitness blog. I don't know if that's ever going to happen, but I would love to have a fitness blog. Hit me up if you want that too. I guess that takes us to the end of our video. If you like this video, then you can hit the thumbs up button. Also, if you want to subscribe to me on social media, that's Snapchat, Twitter, and Instagram. And my Hot Mess Express tip of the day is... My Hot Mess Express tip of the day is just to keep going. I know that sometimes things get hard and you want to give up, but really just keep going because there are much brighter things ahead in your journey. I think that's it. Happy Valentine's Day to those of you who celebrate. Otherwise, I'll see you in the next one.